morning, everyone. Happy Monday. Headed to downtown Kansas City right now for a pitch meeting. Then have another one after that. Back here in the studio. Probably showing some visuals, playing some songs. We'll have a photo shoot this afternoon and then have a worship leader training I'm doing tonight for my online worship leader community. All right, here at the studio, about to have another potential donor come in, showing them some visuals from the show, playing them some songs from the show. We'll let you guys know how it goes. All right, so they just left. It was a really, really good meeting. I'm grateful for people to come here to the studio. I mean, next you stop and think about it. People are like really, really busy. They have a lot of stuff going on. So the fact that number one, you just agree to a meeting, to hear your songs, to see the visuals you created for a show just means a lot. So there's there's a part of me really, really grateful for that. I think that's wisdom to, to always remain grateful. You can't make it all about the pitch. You can't make it all about a yes or no. It's just sitting here really, really grateful. Just incredible people that I've gotten to meet over these years. Thinking and praying about it was, was kind of the response that, that I got, which again, got to be like super grateful for. Headed out now. We got to do some photos for some things we got coming up. I have a couple of meetings tonight for the worship leader stuff that I do, the online coaching. That's what Monday looks like. My hard deadline that I'm really putting before the Lord, first and foremost, through, in prayer, you know, December 1st as, as the date that we want to have this. All right. Bless you guys. See ya. God. So was slightly stressed there at the end of that. It went really, really well, actually. It went really, really well. Praying about it, thinking about it was the response, but there was a lot, a lot of promise in the meeting and they seem to really, really be into what we're doing with this Christmas show. The adrenaline, the end of meetings like that. I was just feeling it. I was just feeling it. So we, we pray and we wait. Two week worship nights tour as a family. So we'll be doing eight different nights of worship in eight different cities uh, over the next two weeks. Typical schedule on these trips, you drive four to five hours a day, roll into a city around 12 or one o'clock post up either in the hotel lobby or I'll find a coffee shop. Yes, you're going to see more coffee shops over the next two weeks. And I'll get a couple hours of work in, have dinner with our hosts, do the night of worship, go to sleep, get up, do it all again. My prayer is that these nights of worship would be filled with the presence of God, that it wouldn't just be playing some songs. If you're watching this, just shoot up a, a 15, 30 second prayer for us. I'd, I'd appreciate that. So we're heading out today. It's going to be an amazing, amazing time. And we'll take you guys on the road. Stopped in a nature preserve looking for eagles. That's a big swamp land. So I got what's called the Autumn Shaken Espresso. So look at that. There's no milk in it, apparently, which I don't know how it's possible. It's like, look at that. But they said it's a shot of espresso with a house-made syrup, which has nutmeg, cinnamon, and one other thing in it, and a shot of espresso, and then they shake it up and they put it over ice. But that's like almost 16 ounces. It tastes like a latte, which is okay. It's okay. I wouldn't get it again, but it's okay. All right, so we got 45 minutes here until I have to head out to sound check. So the objective of the next 45 minutes is to look at my fundraising list here of people that I've reached out to and send really kind, warm follow-ups. That's what we're doing. Early morning workout here in downtown Omaha, the old market, my favorite area. Shout out to my friends who own the table down here, breakfast and lunch spot, and they got a church connected to it. It's where we had the worship last night. Really cool area. All right, I've been here many times before. Last time I was here, my shot wasn't amazing. So we'll give it another try here. So last time I was here, I had a shot and it was not awesome. So they said, next time you're in, we'll pull you a new one. Got this one in the house. They did not specify what it was. And it's pretty crazy busy in here. So I did not ask. Mm, smells super sour. Sometimes that can be a good thing. Hmm, very interesting. I kind of like it. It's like a burnt marshmallow. Very burnt marshmallow. It's like a hint of peach. Hmm, hmm. Hmm, hmm. 